I leadership of leading them. Stop running these guys. Problem is I always just like to control click all of my units at the same time, but that's not working out here now, is it? Let's bring my slingers up. It said that reinforcements are coming, but I don't see anybody. There's no notice of enemy reinforcements. So yeah, my long shields are superior to their round shields, therefore they're winning in the battle. What are my onagers doing here? Here, just fire. And my guys, you can see, have silver attack upgrades in. Oh, well, at least my Libyans do, and all my troops have silver defense. I mean, bronze defense. So we have finally captured their walls. Here, let's start to fighting over on this. Well, actually not. Bring this cav unit around their flank. Charge their general with both of our cav units. Bring in our infantry and, I guess, attack them on the flank. Why are our slingers not shooting? Whoa, did my guys just chain route over there? Okay, okay, that's cool. Jesus Christ, things really took us out. We're turned, didn't they? Okay, let's cease firing with our onagers. I feel like that's why we lost tr all those troops to a chain route, was because we started killing our own men. Uh, uh, uh. Here's the... Guys that retreated out, okay, they've stopped routing, good. Send them in here, we've kind of sandwiched the enemy defenders at the wall between our two forces. So here's the reinforcements, there's a bunch of war dogs. <sighs> so many doggies. War Dogs, I still think, are one of the dumbest units of this game. But now that we have started to gain an edge within the walls, I can start regrouping into a single focused unit of men with my Libyan Spearmen. I'm going to halt my Slingers and pull them back out. Yeah, rally men, rally! Keep up the pressure on them, so, so far. It's been a bloody engagement indeed. But I think we are getting the better of them. Yes. Alright, let's pull back my cav forces now. As well as my infantry forces. See, if they try to come here at my men, then I'll have a bunch of... They'll basically be met by a wall of... Um, not a wall. A barrage of sling stones and um, catapults. Blast. I don't, I don't even... I can't think of the correct terms. Huh? Missiles. There we go. Hail of missiles. Oh, crap. Is that my general in there? No. No, thank God not. 
it's an armored bodyguard. No, it's just normal bodyguard because we haven't hit the max, the re Marian reform since Marian never was able to reform anything since the Romans are all dead. Woohoo! We did it, everybody. We beat the Romans. I, I'm very proud of that. You'll be able to beat them before the Marian reforms. Because once the Marian reforms come there, you know, even if they, they have already basically been torn to pieces their forces oh i hope to god my general doesn't die that'd be a great way to end this let's play oh well, let's just pull them out right now to make sure all right let's move our slingers up I still wish we could have ended this with Theophanes leading this battle. Or maybe I could have brought in um, Bamlakar from uh, Greece, but no, begin over in Spain, ending in Spain. It's a nice little way, you know. Taking over Carthago Nova for our last fight. We can see my Libyans are just pounding through, tearing apart their men. And oh, you're bloody good enough. So they're gonna be entering range soon enough. Bringing my general a little closer. Not the fighting man that Theophanes was getting in the fray himself. Getting up to gold experience for his bodyguard. Holy crap, that was awesome. So we are just about in control of the town square now. Our onagers are opening fire on the war dogs now. And why are our slingers not? They really have that little range. Good lord. Whatever. Whatevs, man. Let's go on the explode, not exploding, fire shells. Shells, I don't know what I'm talking about anymore, how do I? You know what I'm talking about, people. Um, so yeah, our slingers are now opening fire. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty, pretty cool. War dogs are being pelted. Those dastardly war dogs. What? How better could I end this than destroying my nemesis, the war dogs? Ah, uh, run, you fools! Yes. Die, war dogs, die. Over in the town square, the last little remnants of the Spaniards are fighting on against us. Oh god, <laughs> there's thousands of them! Ah. Oh, they're all routing back in, isn't, isn't that funny? Ain't that just silly? I'd hate to be these guys right now. Yeah, my general can intercept them, make sure they don't come back here. Interfere with the last little bits of the fighting for the town square. What are these ten men left, they say? Nine war war hound war hound. Oh my god, I've been saying it wrong this whole time. But guess what? I really don't care. Uh damn war dogs. I hate them. You deserve to be in this awesome game. Come on, they're, they're right there. Kill them. Kill them. They're, they're, come, come on. Oh, well. Yay. Two of them left, and all of these guys are just swamping them. Uh, 11 guys left, they're breaking. 
Seriously, we've already won the battle, and you're breaking now. No, they're not. Don't, don't run, men. Don't. I had a nice end and finishing touch to our campaign. Kill them all. Leave no war dog alive. I I will kill every single war dog I see. At this point, I hate them that much. The annoying part is, though, you can't just target the dogs that specific way. Anyways, for our last little glimpse at the last battle that we will fight in this campaign, maybe from time to time, just for wanting to, I'll load up the game, but, you know, effectively, the Let's Play is over. Doesn't mean I'm not done with Rome Total War. Maybe I'll do another one. Definitely when Rome 2 comes out, I'll try that out. Um, you know, I'll actually, uh, I was thinking I want to do a review for the game. I, I really like the game. Um, just give my opinions on it. You know, it would also be a nice little, like, show what I want improved in Rome 2 and all. But, yay, we won. See ya.